Daniel, it was a very busy weekend for the Pirates. Uh, in some ways, uh, a lot of eggs were in the one basket on Friday against Pacific. Uh, you knew what you were going to face on Saturday against George Fox and the defending champions, and then uh, Sunday an opportunity to finish conference well at Willamette. Uh, take us back through the weekend, and especially that really close, hard-fought match on Friday. Yeah, so like you said, the Pacific match was the big one. Um, you know, obviously ended up losing 4-5, which, uh, you know, made it effectively impossible for us to make the conference tournament. Um, still some good things. Uh, our, our number one singles player came back. Um, he was down 5-2 in the third set, saved four match points, won the match. So that was a really good win for him. Um, but then the, the bottom of our lineup just kind of... You know, they were definitely competitive in their matches, but just couldn't quite get it done. So, um, yeah, ended up losing 4-5. Um, then, like you said, you know, George Fox, defending champions, um, they're, they're obviously tough on a good day. And kind of the, um, the team was very down after losing to Pacific the night before. So um, it, it was tough for everybody to kind of be motivated when they kind of knew the season was effectively over. Um, so, you know, realistically, it would have been tough for us to beat them anyways. And then adding in that, you know, the energy was just down. It was, it was a pretty tough match, uh, to, to see. So, um, that was, you know, kind of expected going into that. I knew it would be tough for us. Um, and they're, you know, they're, they're a very good team. So, uh, that, that's, you know, kind of a, an expected result given how, uh, the day before had gone. Um, and then, yeah, well, Lama, you know, their, their team is, um, uh, has been a bit down the past few years, um, so we we knew going in that we would you know probably come away with a win. Um, it was very good to end the season on a high note. Well, end the conference play, I should say. We still have one more match, but um, you know, nice to end on a win at least, and hopefully that kind of carries into this weekend, and then the the guys can kind of um, you know take that. Uh, you know, what worked for them in, in those matches and, and hopefully carry that into the summer and, and, you know, come back stronger next year. So, obviously the, the big goal of making the conference tournament not going to happen this year. No. Uh, but as you look back on this season, what are some of the milestones that you will um, mark as, okay, this showed we made strides? Um, the... We had, so a close match with Lewis and Clark State, 3-4. Wasn't their, you know, top lineup, but regardless, they're, you know, they're, they're very good. Um, so that was good to see. The win against Whitman obviously was uh, tremendous. You know, everybody felt great about that. It's unfortunate that it was the exhibition and not the conference match, but, um, you know, it is what it is there. But that was, that was a really, really good moment for the team where I think they kind of realized, like, we, we can be competitive with, with the top teams in the conference. Um, and then, you know, we were kind of going over our record, and our record is not good by any means, but we lost, um, uh, I think, four or five matches, uh, either three, four, or four, five, and then we obviously played, you know, Montana, Montana State twice, so that's four just kind of automatic losses, so the... We're, we're very close to, you know, flipping those matches, and realistically we should have won a lot of those matches that we lost 4-5. So um, even though we lost them, uh, I would still consider it a highlight that we are taking steps in the right direction and we're getting closer to being uh, more competitive within the conference. Uh, so this week you're going to finish with Lewis Clark State, a uh, team that you had a very close match with previously. Um, what is the you know what what is the outlook for this match and and what do you hope to use it for as you build toward next year? Yeah, I think you know uh, I'm hoping that that we can kind of treat this like as our conference tournament in a sense. Like this, you know, this is obviously the last match, so there's nothing else after this. Um, so you know, just give it everything you've got. Um, really take you know take it seriously. Don't take it as like oh you know the season's over. We can just kind of coast. Um, I'm assuming we're going to get uh, more of their kind of top lineup this time. I don't think they're splitting their team uh, between two matches. So it should be very, you know, competitive for our guys. Um, playing at the same time as the women's team, which is always fun. You know, we don't get to uh, see each other play that often, so it'll be, it'll be really fun to play with each other. And, um, yeah, just, you know, kind of going out. This is the last match of the year and, and just, just 
fight for every point and you know try to get some wins so